had a little technical issue, but uh, let's just pretend the VOD starts here. Hey, YouTube, welcome to the stream. Thanks for clicking. Um, long story short, just because I was playing Banjo-Kazooie before this, I forgot to swap the layout to the non-cutoff mode, so we're back here. But it's cool. It's like five minutes, so we'll just redo the five minutes. Uh, I'm going to try my best to head out to Elden today. That is the theme. Chat thinks I might not uh, get there, and probably. <laughs> but it was nice to play the N64, so. There is a shrine over here that I have discovered, so let's just go do that. Yeah, I'm gonna have to be careful about that next time I play. Just make sure that I swap the layouts. It's just force of habit, because I haven't played anything else aside from Zelda games for the last two months, so... Yeah, it's just getting used to that again. But yeah, I, I haven't run into Hestu outside of, uh... The town, so I guess there's a Hestu quest somewhere. I think the reason I'm already worthy is because you're supposed to escape that the hands there. But I just didn't run into them, they just didn't appear. Those hands are creepy, but they're awesome. I just need to find the entrance again. Yeah, if you ever see something wrong or feel like I haven't said anything in a while, <laughs> like over two minutes, point it out. Even if it might necessarily be in, uh, intentional, it's at the very least, sometimes you will save my ass in terms of uh, a VOD not being ruined. Okay, that is new. Alright, there. Yeah, these blue peas lead you to caves, which is something that I realized. Thought oh, something was wrong with your phone. Nah, just... Even if you feel that, just be like, is it just me or... And then just see if it's a consensus or if it's just you. I, tr I try to make things as best as possible in terms of viewing experience, so I do care about that stuff. Even if it's not something that's necessarily my fault, which in this case it 100% was, I would still rather be uh, safe and just be like, nah. Oh, so this is what was supposed to happen, and this is why I was worthy. Just ignored it. <laughs> Just went straight past it. It just didn't appear. Well, that that's the thing. It's, it did not get very far at all, thankfully.
I'm kind of curious about the Hestu thing. Because I've been trying to do all the quests. So, I guess I've missed one, huh? Okay. I'm, I'm ready. It was right at the beginning. That's so weird. Why haven't I run into him? Okay. Uh, I mean, that should be good enough. Messing around. to swap to You need food, get some nuggies. Just kick back and watch and just eat nuggies. Or do you mean Link needs more food? But you're talking about yourself. Which, probably. I have a lot of buff food, I don't have a lot of just standard food. I'm good, I've eaten. I'm, I'm fine. I still have some leftover pizza, so if I do get hungry later... Oh wait, there's still a... Uh... No, you want to be six years old because of the dino nuggets? I mean, do you have to be six years old to have them?
Sino is about Dino Nuggets too. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't saying that they weren't a thing. It's just, I guess, my childhood was like, whatever the cheapest brand is, no novelty. No sense of wonder. Like what, alphabet pasta? Get the fuck out of here. We're gonna pay another four dollars just so you can have shapes in your pasta. Eat your damn fucking pasta. <laughs> That's not- the, my parents were not like that, just to be clear. They weren't like that. They're not mean. But... They did under- they did, uh, you know, they were pretty... Not completely transparent, but honest in that regard, saying, you know... Just gotta live within your means, and it's just- sometimes it's... To make ends meet, so we all can live comfortably is just you're not gonna get alphabet pasta or in the case of chicken nuggets they're just gonna be chicken nuggets they're not gonna be shaped like dinosaurs that's all remember alphabet cereal we may not have had that here This is why me as a 30-something-year-old man got Pokemon cards, because I never got to have them as a kid. And people wanted to see me open them, so, you know. is that? Oh, it's just this thing. <laughs> Death from above. <laughs> this is a talus, isn't it? It's a talus. Okay, um... happened there? Whoa! <laughs> what was that explosion? <laughs> it's the battle tower. It's the first time I fought one of these. Hammer, 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 hammer. That was fun. Tell you what, next time I go shopping, I'll look for the damn dinosaur nuggets and I'll have some. I'll have some on stream and then I'll give my thoughts. It's easier to commit to than having pancakes. Um... It wears down the... Yeah, I mean... <laughs> I think if I make a, a stupidly strong sword and just use that to snipe bosses, it should be fine. No pancake party. I didn't say that. It's just... It's stick. Didn't say that. Don't have an axe, do I? Not technically, okay.
Okay, so I mean, it already has something attached to it. I may as well do that. Where'd it go? That. Haven't gone to Lost Woods yet. I mean, I've, I've flown above it and tried to drop into it. I tried to sneak in, but no, I haven't been inside the woods properly. What's this? Oh, it's simple. What a surprise to see. What a surprise it is to see you here after all this time, Link. How did I not run into Impa sooner? I heard you had gone missing. It is certainly a relief to see you back and in one piece, more or less. And Princess Zelda, where is she? Oh. But she has still yet to return. In that case, we must use all available means to search for her. Link, when Princess Zelda went missing, something else happened all over Hyrule. During the upheaval, huge pictures appeared out of nowhere. Images that sprawled across fields and hills. Oh, cool. It's oh. this. We are calling them geoglyphs. I understand they have been found in locations across the kingdom. Kaido and I are traveling from region to region in hopes of seeing them all. I noticed this geoglyph from a distance while I was standing on high ground. Examining it up close, I could not make out what it depicted. Although, I might have a better view from up in the sky. I took to the air in the balloon Pera gave me, but then, alas, the wind struck and completely sheared the balloon off at the base. I have racked my brain for ways to reattach the two parts to no avail. Okay. Two parts? What's the other part? Oh, there's a torch here. Okay, hang on. Um, I mean, eh, it's not a big deal to just... Uh-oh. Oh? <laughs> what the... Ah! Come back, you forgot me. Isn't that what I was supposed to do? Yeah. Starting over. All I need is a clear view of the jiggler. What? But what? Just get in the balloon, old lady. Why won't she get in the balloon? Get in the balloon. Why are you not getting in the- Why are you no get in balloon? No, I don't- Don't do that. That is dumb. Hmm. That, oh, you fixed my balloon. What? Oh. No, I forgot. Would you mind one final thing? Lighting it. Light a fire there, and the balloon will start to float, then we can be on our way. Why didn't it register the first time? I haven't done this yet, no. I don't need... I guess I just went past this. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Too high, I feel faint. Hmm. But we can finally see it, the geoglyph. Well done, Link. You know, I read something in the village's old literature. A passage about what the ancients called the dragon's tears. Where the tears rest upon the earth, we mark down the images to which they gave birth. I believe this geoglyph is one such image. But even from this vantage, its meaning is no clear to me. Nor can I figure out what dragon's tears might be. You know, 
If the literature is correct, one of them should be quite close, near the geoglyph, or even within its borders. Can you look around? If you would like to examine the geoglyph at a ground level, you can float down with a paraglider. Don't worry, I can make a simple landing. Okay. Oh, is this a Korok? for. Huh. Okay, so... One kilo of dino nuggets costs thirteen dollars fifty. One kilo of hot and spicy super crispy chicken nuggets costs fifteen dollars fifty a kilo. But that's where are the regular ones? Yeah, so thirteen dollars versus They're the same. Oh. Hello. What are you? Well, I mean, I have an air fryer, so I can put it to use. Oh, I get it. Tears of the Kingdom. Ha <laughs> ha. Title drop. Is buying nuggets by the kilo enough? I mean, this is supermarket stuff. I don't think they have any bags bigger. Like, you'd have to go to Costco or something. Oh, it's Zelda. Is this just this game's memories? Oh, dear. Yes? Oh, okay. Oh, it's her. She was in the trailer. She's the queen, I guess. Where am I? We didn't mean to startle you. I'm sorry. It's okay. My name is Sonia. Cool, uh, and could body we... art. What your name is? I... I am the daughter of King Rome of Hyrule. Zelda. Oh, oh couldn't just say Zelda. We are the king and queen who founded Hyrule after all. Or at <laughs> least we were the last time I checked. You two founded Hyrule? And you're the king? Hmm. My name is Raru. King Raru of Hyrule. King Raru? And Queen Sonia? So now you've ordered your nuggets after talking so much about it. You're welcome. But it's good to see you're not letting your dreams be dreams and just... Having the nuggets. Okay, so Zelda quite clearly got uh, sent to the past. So, okay. I had a feeling that was the case.
The tears memories are awesome. Yeah, I like that cutscene. It's too early for nuggets. Never! It's never too early for nuggets. Oh. <laughs> Link, you look distracted. What's wrong? That would be taking, like, saying it's too late for pancakes. Goodness, you say you had a vision, saw mysterious figures, and then Princess Zelda, hmm? The geoglyphs, the literature, the dragon's tears, and now a vision of the lost princess. What if these are all connected? Let us continue to examine the geoglyphs. They contain further clues that lead to Princess Zelda. You know, according to the literature, there is something to do with geoglyphs in the Forgotten Temple. The Forgotten Temple lies at the bottom of a canyon in Hebra. I think we should make... Our, oh, that's like nearby. I should probably go there, huh? Before 11 is too early, I disagree. Because if that's the case, then why am I going to have pancakes at 1 in the morning? It's like, if, if it's too early for pancakes... For nuggets, then it's too late for pancakes. But you're talking about having a time range for food, which... If you feel like eating something in particular, just eat it. Don't let these social constructs of when you should or should not be eating food affect your decision making. Be your own person. These impose social constructs on when you should eat a particular kind of food. What are you doing, man? It's too early. You're eating chicken nuggets at 8 in the morning. What the fuck's wrong with you? You are no longer my friend. Like, come on. Pancakes are for any time, but there are people out there that would say they are breakfast food and you shouldn't have pancakes, at least, you know, the ones that you put syrup on. Savory pancakes are a completely different story. Savory pancakes are a completely different story, but some people would argue they're breakfast foods and you shouldn't have them outside of breakfast. I guess what I'm saying is like, Arbitrary rules of time to have when it's okay to have a particular kind of food. I don't know. I think chicken nut. You can eat anything whenever you want. That is my stance. You can have chicken nuggets for breakfast. And I have definitely done that before. Or you can have pancakes for dinner. You could have eggs for dinner if you want too. So many times I had late night meals that were effectively breakfast sandwiches. Interesting. I guess... Don't let society try to dictate when you're going to eat your those those chicken nuggets is all I'm saying. If you feel like chicken nuggets, eat your chicken nuggets. Come back. You know, someone went to the effort of designing this puzzle. I don't know how long they would have spent designing this. Proud of their work. And then here I come.
Or does that want me to go? It wants me to hit that, apparently. Well, see, this is there's no cheesing this one. Short. Can I really do this this way? No, see, it's okay, because this one... This one is just then this, right? Is there a chest up there, you think? Doesn't look like it. Okay, this one doesn't look like I can cheese it. of ladder. Another, that's a, I guess this is a tr uh, transport. Okay. Come back, come back. Okay, what would you have to do to ch chicken nuggets to make it constitute a breakfast food? Like, what would you what would you have to do to chicken nuggets to be like, okay, yeah, this is now a breakfast food? Like, you can't have them on their own. So, what would you have to do to them? Because sometimes there are certain things that the moment you have foods adjacent, then it becomes breakfast food. You know. No breading with potatoes and eggs, but... So the breading is the problem, then? What if you had breading and then it had potatoes and eggs? Or what if you had the breading and a side of bacon and eggs? Because I feel like there's things that have breading and are still classified as breakfast food. Like, take hash browns. Aren't hash browns just potatoes and breading? So w what is it about breaded chicken that doesn't make it a breakfast food when breaded potatoes are counted as breakfast foods? Chicken and waffles is a breakfast food. I'm not sure. It's either a breakfast food or it's like breakfast food that becomes non-breakfast food. This is true, but in the south. Okay. So if you had chicken nuggets with waffles, that would be a breakfast food. But then chicken nugget with potatoes and eggs wouldn't be breakfast food.
<laughs> I'm trying to get to the bottom of this. At what point does it does something go from non-breakfast food to breakfast food? Is it because there are foods that are breakfast foods, truly, but then there are foods that are only breakfast food with adjacent foods? Hey! I flew away. Oh. Careful there, partner. You went and scared all the little birds away. It's too late to be so loud. You go storming around like that, and it won't just be the birds you'll send flying to the hills. It's fine, though. I did hear some interesting chirps and warbles from them. I don't want to say this too loud and start to panic, but rumors are spreading about Princess Zelda that she's been riding some mysterious beast. It is said to be a mountain of a beast, too, with huge, brutal tusks. My little reporters had never seen something so frightening. Of course, what made it far worse was that it seemed like the princess herself was controlling this terrifying creature. I find it hard to believe a beast like that could really be lurking in Hyrule. But if this terrifying monster exists, then the implications make this a very, very huge story. You know, there were guests at the stable talking about some kind of rumored beast. My little bird informants told me that there have been a number of sightings in the subtropical region in the south. If you want to learn more, we should give dive beak first into this stable and others to see if there's truth to these rumors. We just need to peck away at this until we figure out if it's an enticing truth or an elaborate fiction. Okay. Um... Yeah, I guess we're not gonna do this one then. <sighs> legendary weapon, you say. Anya, give that a little more thought. Things with legendary in the title are usually just stories. There's simply no way it exists. Mm -hmm. That rumored beast you're after, that's what's just a story. No, go to any stable in Hyrule and you'll find people excited about rumored beast. Stables are places where information gathers. If it weren't true, you wouldn't hear about it at so many stables. Oh. Even if I grant you that, we don't stand to gain anything by finding this rumored beast. A legendary weapon, on the other hand, is bound to be the strong. Bound to be strong indeed. We would have nothing to fear from monsters. <laughs> what if this weapon is legendarily brittle and useless? Let's start visiting stables to gather information and track down that rumored beast. Wait, it's because traditional breakfast foods are so good you'd eat them any time of the day. It seems weird skipping on these foods to have inferior food at the best time of day. But what makes them the best? Like, is, isn't that... A, like, it's highly, highly subjective? Like, take cereal, for example. Some people absolutely love cereal. And there are other people that don't. It's, that's such a subjective thing, and I don't know, man, I, I, I'm about fuck tradition, you know? Just because something is doesn't mean that it should be a reason that I shouldn't. <laughs> like, why, why can't I have eggs and chicken nuggets and bacon and call that my breakfast? Debating the philosophy. Just a quandary over when does a chicken nugget become a breakfast food? A hot dog is a sandwich, chat. Just saying. I don't know why you're arguing. <laughs> it's okay. I mean, I just like asking questions about that sort of stuff because at a certain point, like, you have to start categorizing things, and then when the moment you do that, you can kind of just stress test that logic. And it's going to fall apart at some point.
Oh, it's... Silas Frog. Well, I'll... I'll look at getting Dino Nuggets. Have like a nugget fiesta. They don't do them before 11, really? They do them before 11 here. There's certain things... Here you can get breakfast items whenever, and you can also get items that you wouldn't find ordinarily. Nuggets are one of them. Yeah. Custom already, early bird, huh? I'm in the middle of something, but if you'd like to use the stable, you can go up to the counter. What are you up to? Well, since you asked. <laughs> After a long, tireless search, I found a wagon to call my own. Look at this beaut. Mm. Okay, yes, clearly a fixer-upper. But I can replace the missing wheels using building materials from the stable. Then I have to catch a wild horse to hook the wagon to. Building yeah. materials? Stash of building materials, oh. okay. They do have one thing in common. They're open for everyone to use. No questions asked. Ah. Wild horse. You can make it your own. Okay. Oh. Okay. And I haven't had a good track record with carts. <laughs> so far. Uh, it's been kind of disastrous with carts. Exhibit A. <laughs> what? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> ah! L look at what's happening. It's deciding to... Why is it deciding to snap there? Oh, there we go. Oh, why? It's fixed. If you could get sausage and egg muffin any time of the day, you wouldn't order anything else or cider nuggets. You can do that here. You can get a sausage and egg McMuffin any time. It's fixed. Did you do this for me? Uh. Thank you so much. It's like a brand new wagon with wheels and everything. Now, I'm only one step away from my dream of having a horse-drawn wagon. Mm. Of course, that last hurdle is the hardest, catching a wild horse. As soon as I get a new wild horse, it runs off. How am I going to catch one? Um, I'll just take out one of mine and they can have it. Yeah. Ah. I got another reward. Ah. Ah. Take oh. horse. Ah. This was from my... S ah. oh. Change equipment. Mm. That'll do. Oh, there you are. Unless this doesn't count, let's see. Wild horse. Oh, okay, it can't be my horse. I was just being lazy. Oh. Ah. Ah. Oh. Ah. Okay, they're just over there. I love how I've been playing this for over an hour and I'm still not going to Elden. I'm not going to Elden today, am I? It's just not going to happen. Oh. 
Oh, that was easy. Oh, it's even got like a little tear icon on the, uh, the map. Hey, hey! <laughs> I've lost control of the horse! <laughs> kind of amazed that it jumped all that. There you go, here's a horse. Did you catch this angel for me? It's just what I pictured, perfect for pulling my wagon. All yours. Huh, you mean that? You'd really part with such a wonderful horse? Thank you. Who knew stuff like this really happened? I'm so, so happy. I'll just go ahead and put a harness on it. A harness? A harness is a piece of equipment that you can put horses you own. With a harness, you can connect your horse to a wagon or any item you need to take somewhere. Collect enough pony points, you can get one as a prize. So bear with me a moment. So this was the tutorial to learn about harnesses, which I guess I just didn't do. Which means I would imagine Hestu's quest is around here. <sighs> and we're all set. Uh? I can't believe it, a wagon of my own and a beautiful horse to pull it. To think I started with that old piece of junk and ended up with this, amazing. <laughs> Thank you so, so much, here. It's all I have left after buying the wagon. I'm begging you, no, forcing you to take it. Good. <laughs> oh, that's right. There's one last order of business. What's your name? Oh. Link. Hmm. Zumi? Link? Maybe Zuli? Maybe Lumi? Or how about Zunk? I'll call this wagon Zunk. <laughs> uh, I promise to look after Zunk for as long as I live. Come free to visit us anytime. I like Zunk. That's a good name. Move. What? Ugh, stupid camera. There we go. Uh, okay, I guess I should get my reward, huh? Ah. You'd like to get your pony points reward, right? As a reward for 10 points, you can now register an additional horse. Ah. Okay, two more points and you get a traveler's saddle. All right. Okay, uh... So, I should look around and see if Hestu's here. I mean, what if this is a quest I can't get anymore? <laughs> I'm keeping that photo. That's a pretty good photo too. Yay! There we go. 
Nice photo. I mean, you would think with Hestu, I'd be able to see Hestu from a distance. It's assuming it's even here. Maybe the quest it just doesn't work anymore because I've already donated seeds to him, so I doubt he would give me... Look at my quests, hold on. He was on the main road going to the tower to the west. Hmm. Okay, so... I guess if I follow that main road into central Hyrule... I'll have a look. What is this? I see a chest. Northwest going to Rito Village. Wait, here? Or... Here? <laughs> the second one. Okay. Hmm. right next to it, so follow this road, I guess. I need a new axe. Uh... I don't really care about these blades. These ones, they just do wind and they kind of shatter easily. Alright, so we'll make that an axe. on the way to which tower? Oh, on the way to this tower. What the... How did I not... How did I not run into him? Alright, this is the road. Because I did that tower on my way to the Rito area. How did I not run into him? Let's 
so weird. Okay, I haven't done this. Oh, this is an interesting one. Well, he's he's just at the landing. I mean, that's where he is for me. Honestly, probably enough. <laughs> Not what I was trying to do, I was trying to... Sure, let's just try it. Yep. Not the president standing. That was brilliant. I would have thought of it. Okay. I wonder if I've just locked myself out of this now. Okay. I still don't see him. There's some trees over here. Otherwise, I'm kind of out of ideas where he would be. Oh. <laughs> I need to reach my friend. Oh, wow. That's ages away. That is a long way away. What have I even got as Zonai devices? I have rockets, I have... I don't have wheel. Oh no, I have wheels. It doesn't handle hills or bumps well. Nah. I'm just gonna have to walk this one across. What if I put a steering wheel on the Korok? Just drive the Korok there. Alright, we'll just go for a leisurely stroll along the countryside, it's fine. To reach my friend.
I mean, at this point, at this point. That's gonna work. Okay, we need a flat piece of land like this. Perfect. Kinda. I'm gonna use one rocket. We'll use one rocket to get him there quicker. I think I can afford a single rocket. Hang on. It's a little, a little bit lopsided. I'll get this right. I'll get this right. How are you? How are you getting this? Where are you getting this momentum from? Okay. <laughs> and the. Uh... <laughs> this doesn't stay upright. Maybe I should do this the other way. Hang on. I have a, how I can do this. Put the rocket down. That's standing. And now it's easier to do this, I think. There we go. There we go. Alright, and now... Turn it. We're going to use... The salt tactic. Okay, so let's just position it like this, right? I really don't have bad bars right now. I guess this one. <laughs> really? <laughs> That's all. Okay. Well, now he's uh kind of in danger. I need to reach my friend. That didn't really save me time. In the time that it took me to attach that rocket, I could have just gotten here. Aw, oh, that's good. So, yeah, I've kind of uh, completely gone off course here. Gonna be fighting these every time. Okay. 
Okay, uh, what have we got? Nah. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Ow. That's also gotta hurt. strong thing. It's just so later I don't have to do that at the end. Just bait them. <laughs> oh. It's a well here. This goes further down. Oh no, it goes to the depths. Or not? What the fuck is this? I can't see a thing, chat. Okay, I'm on a wall now. Over there. I think what I need to do... Okay, there we go. There we go, now I can see what I'm doing. We're gonna rely on this strategy. To get across, just keep replenishing stamina. I think I don't know if this is a bug or if this is an intended change, but I'm gonna be using it. of area. I'm good. Frog. There's a bunch of like-like.
Okay. Oh, wait, no. Get rid of this one. Nice distraction. Is it going to undo everything I just did? In terms of uh, light sources? Oh, it's a blessing. I mean, I guess this was a little challenging. I have enough for another heart, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm not sure I'll be going a second stamina wheel. It just depends, because in Breath of the Wild, you couldn't get maximum both, and I would rather have maximum health than max stamina, because I can do without max stamina. I'm just used to not having stamina, so... Already I'm kind of living luxuriously, even with one extra wheel. Okay, it's still, it's still all lit up. But I mean, is this a, does this classify as a cave, or is it just a well still? I guess I haven't found a cave entrance, so I could just assume it's a well. Okay. 
it doesn't look like there's anything else to this. This is where I fell in. Okay. I don't know if I should keep looking. Maybe I should just look for the exact location of this. The only thing I worry is that I might come across a spoiler for something by looking into this. I look around where there's trees nearby and there's, I haven't seen anything. Korok, Korok. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's going on? There we go. Yeah, haha. I might give up on this. <laughs> I haven't seen anything. Unless it's it's up that road. But I feel like I would have seen it when I was at the tower. If it was there, I'd be even more shocked. Because how could I have missed it? I'll look at the tower area. But I, I get the feeling maybe I've blown my chance to get this. I bypassed it, I guess. Even if I found it, like, how would it work? Because I've already given them Korok seeds. What's the name of the quest? I'll see if I have the quest in my adventure log.
Definitely would have run into it if it was. Pesto's concern. Okay, let's see. And that's there. But I didn't run into him here. I guess you can run into him in the town? I don't know. Weird. I did do it, but I swear I didn't run into him here, unless I have that bad of a memory. Now I'm gonna have to look at my past VODs and just see. Because... I He's pretty much right next to Impa, if I'm reading your description correctly. Like, if you run into Impa, you're gonna run into Hestu. But I didn't run into Impa. Maybe it just because I talked to him in town and just said, oh, okay, yeah, this is done. Alright, whatever. It's done. That's the important thing. It's done. The first time I saw him, I, I'm pretty certain, was in town. Yeah. Just at the landing. And I'm like, oh, Hestu's here. Cool. I don't have to go look for him. Because I was gonna go look for him in the Korok Forest. That's what I distinctly remember. That's what I was saying. I was like, oh, I don't have to go look for him. Cool. He's just here now. I've only ever seen him at Lookout Landing. I mean, it's fine. This wasn't a waste. I found another shrine and did other stuff, so... It's okay. There was stuff that I didn't address here, so... A, it's really a, like a troll on the bridge. <laughs> That's what it is. That's fine, I can I can fight you. Finox. You got to pay the troll toll. Where's the Korok? There's always a Korok at the bridge. Every bridge has one. Maybe this one doesn't anymore.
Hmm. I don't see anything that would be like ya ha ha worthy. Another chef journal. This well proved more than comfortable than I expected. Not too hot, not too cold. Cozy. I had no need for heat resistant chili ingredients or cold resistant warm ones. I cooked for pleasure instead of survival. For a time, I considered tilling the soil in here, living off the land until the end of my days, but times have changed. The upheaval formed a myriad of new caves. Consider my curiosity peaked. Unexplored lands are a veritable buffet of cooked materials, and I, Oritamu, intend to dig in. Okay, it's just... Oh. Flavor text, but I'll take your pumpkin. Since you're not coming back, this is abandoned. My gain. I don't know if I could live in a well. It would just attract spiders. Okay. You know what? There was a spot that now I just remembered. There's a spot where I ran into three of these trees in a row. And I was like, that's weird. Three of the. I, you don't see three of them in a row like that, back to back. Maybe that's where that quest would have been. Because I do have a memory of going somewhere where three of them attacked me in a row. have to look at it later. A windy device. And that's what it would be. Oh shit, no! Oh, it respawned it. <laughs> okay, so that that would have been a soft lock. Quite clearly. Good, they, they took that into account. Someone who would be insane enough to destroy. Um, what is something I can use to not... Ha. 
grandma. There we go. Okay, but like, this should be straightforward enough. I know this is not the intended way, but I want to do it this way. So I think it would be fun. It doesn't work. It doesn't have the power to fly, really. Why? Why not? So the way I've seen it, oh, oh, come back. I was going to say the way that I've seen it is like this. The intended way for once. at the time. It's been an hour and a half and I still haven't really made any moves towards Elden, have I? <laughs> I will, I will make a move towards this soon. Soon. Not the Wind Temple entrance, this one.
This is gonna save me a little time because I can just dive into uh, where I wanted to go for a while to do that side quest. This area is so cool though, man. Okay, uh, let's swap into... Okay, hold on. Where am I looking at? But are we directly above where I need to be? Kind of. It's over there, so I guess we're pretty close. over here. Cool. We'll save a little time. Apparently just directly past it, so we're dropping. Trying here just to get to the spot easily. Nice shooting. water, isn't it? Okay. Um. Going to cheese it. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put it here. Pull it. Push it. Pull it. And now... Hang in there, Link. We're good. <laughs> That'd be great. What challenge?
Wait, where am I getting the ice power from? Oh, I have a cold weather attack with this. Yo, that's really useful. Before even getting the thing. Bring the stone. Seek the crystal connected to this beam and offer it to the shrine. Do so and I will grant you a light that banishes evil. <laughs> Two steps. After Dan's class, we're back in an hour. No worries, I should still be going by then. Maybe I'll be on the road to Elden by then. Have fun. <clears throat> I mean, this led to another shrine, so... Already worthy. One thing for sure is when I do get to that area, I need to get a uh, red chew jelly. This cave is done. <laughs> Sell me spot. There's probably a bunch of shields. Yeah. I can take photos of all the shields that I don't have.
Fisherman's shield. It's all of them, right? Yeah. Oh, I've been waiting for you. Thanks for coming all the way out here. Mm. You saved Teach. Oh man, do we ever owe you one. Ah. I'm so stoked that Coach came back to us safe. Major respect from me, man. <sighs> Who knows what would have happened to me if you hadn't come along. I've got to admit, getting some shield surfing and all through that cave was pretty darn great. But I'll be staying away from there for a while, that's for sure. Ah. Since I'm the one that really owes you for what you did, I'll be the one to reward you. Take this. Well, I've got a shield for you that's kind of unusual, but your pouch is full. Unusual? Unusual, you say? Oh! Oh. <laughs> I found that shield around some stones that, get this, fell from the sky. What a beautiful thought that there could be shield surfers like us way up there. I'll say it again, thank you for getting me out of that cave. Also, now that the blizzard's over, come back here anytime if you feel like shield surfing with us. I wasn't going to take on a third student, not with these two keeping me busy, but for you I'll make an exception. Mm. Welcome, buddy. We owe you big time for, anyway, for teaching, for rescuing <laughs> Teach. See you on the slopes, best way to learn. Okay, that quest is done. All right, let me have a look at the map. I mean, I'm not, I'm not done with this area. That's the thing, I, I feel like I've barely scratched the surface here. I'll go around the back corner, and then that'll be it. Doesn't make a sound. That's interesting. Let's see if the radar gets a reading around here. Okay, there's one over there. here as well. It's interesting that it's giving me a fast travel to here. The shrine imprisons and purifies the ancient evil. Outside equipment is forbidden beyond this point. Infiltration, it's a snake one.
Okay. Guess I should go for snake strikes. For fuck's sake. Just hide here for a minute. Hmm. Next rock option didn't come up. possible to even do the snake strikes thing. so stupid but I love it it's like I have a spike broom oh shit Bunch of barrels.
That works. <laughs> That's the more challenging one as well. Got a spike ball. Constructs to experience fear. <laughs> nice. a strong construct. If didn't have electric arrows and I was to say tank, yeah, I'd, I'd be going for this. Did it just set off the alarm itself? It's setting off the alarm itself! I'm not the one setting up the alarm. It's <laughs> not fair. Huh? 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 
Okay, you know what? There we go. I don't know what I was so afraid of. <laughs> I'll miss my spiky broom. But at least this other stuff should still be around, right? What? Okay, there we go. What is this? Lightning emitter? I mean, I don't really have interesting stuff going on with my shield, so let's just get these. I might need these. Doesn't look like the one with the the mace remained. It just disappeared. Okay. There's probably still, like, another couple shrines in this area. Honestly surprised there's no Korok here. Alright, Chillin's got this. Yeah. 
Is this anything? It's an enemy. Okay, it's nothing. What? Come here? I haven't. Okay. Yeah, I'll fight the Hinox. Why not? Oh no. Uh, what else have we got? We have Blue Main Lionel Spear, Black Oblin Sledge, Hinox Sledge. This one. Hinox is not happy. Ah! <laughs> it's the second. Because I will need these parts for upgrading, so... Plus it does have the uh the indicator if I defeated it or not. Huck. Yeah, compared to the playthrough I did with Breath of the Wild, this is going to have combat in it. is this seems very out there treasure oh I guess Yeah, ha ha. Okay, so there is a shrine here at the back. this? the ball here? Oh, it's a balloon. I just didn't recognize that. I guess to get back up. Yeah. 
I mean, at this point, hold on. It's probably better. Do this and just save. Really? Ooh, ooh, I don't like this cave. Look at this. I have enough to get the next reward. Oh, I can go down. <laughs> this one's a more dangerous one. Have I taken a photo of you? I have, okay. <laughs> nice. Children once again being MVP. Another one. Okay. No outside tools allowed. Traps. Okay. Interesting. Okay, I mean, it's getting me to bait them.
How do I? That doesn't matter. I don't know what it wants me to do. Oh, fuck off, really? <laughs> so I had to get the sneak strike in, and then it just turns around. That's yeah, fine. much effort. I think I need to make a hammer, so I'll make a hammer. At this point, like I haven't done any other traps. This one I might succeed in. Survive. What? What do you mean? <laughs> How? 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 How could it possibly have survived that? I don't, I don't know how that one survived. <laughs> but it got crushed like a cartoon character and it survived. Whatever, man.
Okay. Let's go out. Where am I? Halfway up a mountain, apparently. I can see if this is anything. Doesn't look like it's an enemy. That's nice. Alright, keep climbing. It's probably worth looking at this peak. These are probably just enemies. Yeah, I have one of these. <laughs> I guess that's balanced. <laughs> But I have these. Alright. Like a chest and something else. Nope, it's an enemy. Okay, I haven't been to these mountains. Yeah, ha ha. Stop. 
I can't believe how simple this one was. Good find. Okay, well that's gotta be a Korok. Be kinda cruel for that to be an enemy at the top of this mountain. Check the next peak as well, may as well. But otherwise, I think we're good for this. At least for the time being. Oh, okay. I'll probably jump on that just to get the height advantage again. I'm pretty sure I have. Yeah, I do. heading that way. I see it. <laughs> I see it.
the angle. Pretty much reach the part where it connects. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Throwing the barrels. Okay. Just ignore it. Don't worry. It's fine. Ignore it. to fight him. And just unequip it. Ow. Go gloom. I have to start using that sword anyway. What the fuck? <laughs> it's 
teleported. I wonder if we can get a sneak strike off it when it's like that. Anyway. Uh, I mean, the Royal Guards, but I'm just pretty much hanging on just in case. Okay. I guess this is technically my weakest bow, huh? The others have an exp uh, potential to grow. That done. Yeah, it's a frost alice. a stronger weapon. Um... This. I've got to recover so quickly. Recover so quickly.
Oh shit! I thought it was. It's annoying. But at least it's a Frost House heart, so I guess that's cool. I can't pick it up, I have to attach it. Uh, I'm gonna put it on the Royal Claymore. Ooh, that's a weapon right there. surprised that was nothing. I'll make this a hammer. timing. Going up. Oh no. Okay, hang on. Arrows. fighting today, huh? Okay, do this first.
Did it work? It worked. Just. Oops. Still fun to fight these things. At the end of the day, just making some nice weapons. Because I'll recover some of the weapons I've found. I think I need to take out more keys. Let's go with this. It's not going to damage me, so. Oh. Wow, I missed this. Two Koroks here. Honestly, good enough. All right, I'm moving now. We are going. Oh, see, I haven't done this either. All right, we're going here. I should find out why this great fairy has uh, gone in, or like what what is required. Leop will be bad back though. I'm going to assume it respawns. Rock. 
Didn't I hear one? I thought I heard one. One of the backpack ones. Maybe I imagined it. You can also see ugly flying over there. Excuse me, are they in a cart? Ooh, this area sucks. Got one. Got two. I also did not think this one through. Oh, they're carrying treasure. Probably, uh, eight. There we go. That was good timing. Ah, oh, this one's back on its horse. Okay, I need to dispose of this one. It's gonna try and get back on its horse. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Knock it off. With you. I don't want anything to do with the world ruined by gloom and ruled by monsters. It's cramped in my flower bud. But better than that there, I'll keep my blessing of clothing enhancement to myself until I hear the sound of a horn. Okay. I mean, I haven't seen anything at a stable yet. That would point towards that. Is this look like something? Just a random rocket next to a snowball.
<laughs> thought I was about to run into a Korok. It certainly seemed that way. Oh. Let's see, I have to do that one here. It's a memory. This is the ice glee. Does, does that count as its terrain? Maybe not. I love how they've gone from something that was really subtle in Breath of the Wild to something that's just the polar opposite, gigantic and obvious. I'm going to ignore that. <laughs> right next door bear. That's random, I'm sure it's not always there.
Oh no, the mate's gonna freeze. Okay, I did get the others at least. That thing's gonna be a nuisance, I'm just gonna do that. Still no sign of it. I'm going to the things that are kind of shaped like tears. trying to do. looking at this from from high up is going to help Walking through everything I feel looks significant. Ooh. Probably gone to that one already. God, this is so annoying. I 
Okay, it hasn't put me back that far. Yeah, okay. Have I got a photo of this one? Let's see. Maybe that'll help. Where is that one? Courage. It's in the mountains. Okay. Doesn't look like I have one up here. I feel like I've looked everywhere though. I'm always assuming that it's kind of in the tear shape. Class. Snowballs. <laughs> Only two more to go. Nice. Almost done. What? I've walked all of them. Yeah, before this becomes a problem. Dealing with that right away. at this through hero mode, so I'm keeping track.
How many tiers have I gotten? Just the one. This is the second one, because I was here. I came back to this area and just had a look. Got a few more shrines. There it is. Jeez. That took a while. I'm not going order. I didn't know there was an order to it. Finally. Finally, it is mine! Why... would they put this here if this is the first area they recommend you? In the shrine, the order was on the wall. What shrine? What shrine? For Impa's quest? What? Yeah. See, I, that was subtle. I didn't notice that. Yeah, see, I didn't go there yet. That's <laughs> ah, fine. Looks like demise. out the fucking Nintendo Switch looking thing. No, come on. Why couldn't she have just done that innately with her hand or something? Has to pull out the fucking Nintendo Switch. <laughs> that was so dumb. Dude, really? Really? Product placement? Really? You don't have to sell us the Switch. We bought one already. Oh my god, that... Uh... 
The impact of the scene just... man. It was cool up until that point. That just took me out of the moment. Did I say, did I just get the last memory? <laughs> Probably. Let's see. No, okay. No, there's more. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, I can't believe that. Thank, thank you, Nintendo device. Yeah, I'll do Impus Quest. It's like over there. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, it doesn't matter too much. Oh, that made me laugh. God, if I don't want spoilers, eh, it's fine. Have I beaten you? I have not. Alright, you're going down. I mean, I kind of assumed, you know, she wasn't around. Everyone in the past suffered the same fate. That's the problem with those memories in this open world format, because then they're really trying to enforce an order on you. Which, I don't know. <laughs> they could have made it so it doesn't matter which one you visit, it just unlocks the memories in a particular order. So like, you know, you visit the first site, it gives you number one. Visit to, you visit to your second site, it gives you number two. There's no reason why they couldn't have done it that way. Instead of trying to force a specific order on you. It's a bit weird, given the point of this world is for you to explore it however you want. I don't know. Just the thought. I kind of figured it was below, but we want to look over here first. It would have been nice. Yeah, it's, it's a bit weird. I don't know. balloon paths to get out of here. That's nice. Thought as much.
not like that? Kind of surprised. Uh oh. Alright, so it needs a hole in the middle. Something like that, but... <laughs> Got the three. And I think this is just the back piece. I think I'm overcomplicating it. Yeah, it's like this. There we go. got memory we haven't even got number one so it's like what <laughs> I think it's fine we'll be all right chillin get him get him do I have to indicate that there's combat first? No? Okay. I'm gonna have to write down the order somewhere. Just treat it like a movie like, hey, you might be wondering how I got here. Well, it's a long story, and so now we've seen, you know, the midpoint, and now we go backwards. <laughs> to the start. It's fine. Took a picture, that's smart. I'll take a screenshot. And by that I mean, like, I'll bring it up on screen, I'll take a screenshot in Windows, and then I'll keep scribbling over it. So then, when I do one, I'll cross it off. Oh, Impus here. Ah, oh, Link, I heard that you and Princess Zelda had gone missing. I'm thrilled to see you alive and well. But where's Princess Zelda? Huh? I see, so Princess Zelda's whereabouts are still unknown, you say. Since that is the case, Link... And perhaps our geoglyph research will be of some use to you. Okay. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> it's just empty now. I don't know why, but I was just... I guess I just had the memory of... Uh, what this used to be. And just was afraid to come here. Hip. 
I mean, there's still camps and stuff, but... Nowhere near the threat it used to be. This one, let's see. I don't. Let's Oh, Link, thank you again for your help with the balloon. I believe there is something related to the geoglyph somewhere in this temple. I'm searching, but so far it has been in vain. The chambers are enormous, so it will be difficult at best. What could it be? Alright, let's just do this first. Building blocks. So trying to get me to do here. Oh, just match. It's almost like a car puzzle. Bigger cube. Hey, <laughs> that's not what I was trying to do. Before I do the rest of that. Surprise that held. Oh, I can just do this. Don't complicate it. On this wrong. Okay. I thought with this one there'd only be one spot it would go, but it's possible this is a joint 
Ja. Ja. Oh, this is still wrong. Why is this wrong? Do I need to take a piece out? No. How far am I? Don't know how to answer that question. That would that would require knowing my end destination. Can't quantify yet. Because I'm unaware of the total number of everything. I just, I'm not good at 3D puzzles. It's just things in a 3D space. But I think I got it now. Yeah, that's fine now. Got it. Yay. <laughs> Power the uh, Nuggies, Messiah. I mean, when the screen comes up, you'll see how many shrines and Koroks I've done, but I'm not sure how far into it I am. That's... I would need to know the total, and that's the spoiler. I don't think I'm even halfway. I don't think I'm even a third of the way. If I was to take a guess, maybe a quarter. A quarter seems about right. Very yummy, nice. I don't even remember how many shrines I've gotten now. Koroks are over a hundred. Underground, I haven't really progressed at all. I think underground is like not even double digit. Sixty-two shrines, six underground routes, one hundred and thirty-nine Koroks. What armor pieces am I wearing? Uh, deity pants, barbarian. Shirt and sneaky, sneaky, uh, mask thing. Thank you again for the help with the. All oh, right, I gotta do the thing. I mean, the other thing is I I only really play this when I'm streaming, so the time you see here is basically the time I play. Huck. Huck. 
Today I played Banjo-Kazooie before this, so I haven't spent as much time today on this. Oh, so behind the... So the, what they're saying is behind the statue there was something the whole time. Which I kind of figured that this place would be a key thing. <laughs> Playing with that, he would be mean. Yeah, well... I mean, I, I was gonna stream it, so... I wasn't gonna play without anyone. This looks like a, this is a spot for a giant battery or something. Eerie. Very cool aesthetic. Okay, you know what I'm going to do, chat? I'm going to save. Oh, it's a map of Hyrule. Order. I guess if I'm reading from left to right. Ah, this place. Ooh. Lady Impa, let's head down. We must investigate up close. But I mean, not everyone's gonna come here. That's the thing. There upon the walls. Are these not geoglyphs? Hmm, what could these this mean? I believe the one we saw was the first one. Okay. Next. According to is near Rito Village. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. I can hardly believe what my eyes behold. Who could have guessed this old ruin still held secrets? It is said that the geoglyphs appeared all over Hyrule during the upheaval when Princess Zelda went missing. Hmm, how are they connected to the images here? There's no time to dawdle. Let us investigate the remaining geoglyphs. Mm. Perhaps you should rest a bit. Oh. Link, if you happen to see a geoglyph during your travels, I urge you to investigate this matter as well. If more strange visions are awaiting at these geoglyphs, just like the one you experienced, well, perhaps they will provide clues that could lead us to Princess Zelda. I just wish it would highlight the ones you've done, you know, that'd be cool. Well, I don't think I can get all ten of them in frame, maybe, let's see. Oh, no, the, the, there is absolutely no way I can get all of them in range, in frame. Okay, so I guess just that's all of them, right? to get the map orientation correct. That's Gerudo. Okay, this is the correct orientation of the map, I think. Or is it? Hang on. Yeah, this is the correct orientation, I think. Because, yep. There's the, th there's the south, the spiral, Luralin. Okay. Shit! Damn it. Go with the spiral. The spiral is Luralin. I mean, that's good enough, I think. Okay. This is gonna take me out, I think. Whoa. <laughs> that was not what I was expecting. 
Where do you go to upgrade the battery? No idea. I haven't done it myself either. What I'm trying to do... I'm going to say before I do it. Okay, I'm going to have to do it from the middle. Oh, there's this. A tear with a tear? A tear with... Is it a tear with a tear? Okay, is it a tear with a tear? A tear with a tear? A tear with a tear? Or a, t a tear with a tear. <laughs> Fucking English, man. <laughs> right. Wait, what am I doing? I think this is the wrong thing to do, but let's just see. If I don't- if I don't drop it and just do this, it should be okay. It's just- it looks like there's a ceiling room and I just want to see if it's anything. Ah! It's okay, it's okay, it's all work. Alright, that should be high enough to get the, the thing. Okay, put it in the middle. it looked like there was a room, but I think I just got pulled. This is taking me outside. Lame. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's still going? Yeah, look at this. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna load, because I don't want to waste those. Okay, so we're done here. Which, so the next memory is here then. Um, okay, let me go to the sky. It's the easiest, yep, from here. Oh, I may as well get it. <laughs> so much for going to Elden, huh? Yes, I'm going to Elden today. No matter what. <laughs> oh, right. It's cold. It's really cold. Wait, so where is it? I should be able to see it from here, shouldn't I? Or 
does it need to be nighttime? I thought it was... Hold on. Yeah, I thought it was here. Or am I wrong in that it's instead here? Is it here? Let me consult the, uh... Wrong one. Yeah, so castle is like... Here. So I should be able to see it from up here. It should be visible from here. Why am I not seeing it? <laughs> it should be visible. Especially now, this is... It should be here. Consult image one more time. Okay, it's like from the castle, exactly west of castle. It's not here. Exactly west of castle is here. So it's this frontier here. Okay. There's no real quick way to go there. I can use this to get along quicker. Alright, so it should be that over there. see a Korok. I was just checking if I had gotten it or not. Ah, oh, come on. It's raining. Okay. What am I looking at here? Mirror image? There we go. Yeah. 
all the times for it to rain. Shouldn't I see the outlines now? I mean, if you think about it, right now this makes sense because there's a massive waterfall here. And if it's coming from that high up, there'd be a little bit of a splash. But I don't think that's the reason it's raining here. But maybe it is. Just stopped. this again. Hmm. Okay. Gotta be over where that bridge is. way to solve that just to go from underneath that no, doesn't matter it's, al it's already done now okay i see it wait no that's another one what I'm almost immediately west of the castle. So I should be seeing it now. saying anything. Damn 
All right, keep going this way. Dude. <laughs> Am I just looking in the entirely wrong spot? Why am I not seeing this? Because from what I saw on the map, it shows this thing. Whoops. Still. tower I can be thrown from. Uh, not nearby. Maybe a rock might fall out of the sky. The nearest one is over that way. It's way too far away. I, I feel like I have seen it before, I just don't remember where. Maybe I should just leave it for now. <laughs> Kept saying, yeah, let's go to Elden. Let's go start Elden. Yeah, Elden, yeah. No, it's, it's just not happened at all. Oh. Well. Yeah, let's go do Elden. Elden. Yeah, I mean, I went to the sky and... Wait, really? Okay, I haven't been to these sky islands. That might be why I'm having problems with this. Oh, goody. start seeing signs of it. Especially if it's west. It's just, I should have seen it by now. What is this? Mm. Need something from me? What are you doing? Oh. A big, I'm here because Honest over there hired me mm. to be. Honest is training pretty heavily so he can bulk up. Ah. I'm just helping with that. Turns out pays pretty well. Honest and I built this training tower. But between you and me, Honest barely did any of the building part. He seriously thinks he's going to bulk up when he won't put the work in. Okay. Oh. 
I'm gonna train again today to become an all-time great Rito Warrior. Rito Warrior? Ha, huh, who are you? Someone else who aspires to greatness? Guess you heard my little pep talk to myself, huh? Talk about embarrassing. For us, Rito, our ability to control the wind is one of our big advantages in fighting monsters. That's why I'm here to train every day. Aren't you curious what kind of training I'm talking about? Of course you are. I use these sweet wings of mine to return the balls that fly at me, pushing them back one after the next. What do you think? I want to try. Ha, think you can wing them like me? Then let me show you how the setup works. <laughs> See that impressive tower back there? We built this baby just for this. The guy operating the tower is Tubbolt. I keep him on retainer so I can train. Mm. Tubbolt will lob balls at you. The game is to return them to the moving basket. Ah. You'll be faced with a total of 12 balls coming at you. Getting a green ball is worth one point. A red ball gets you three. I don't see a featherless guy like you doing it my way, though. Use any tools to return them. All right. Yeah. Rabbit hole begins. Hey! Here goes. Ah! And I'm itching to start. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> Look in the background. Talk about rabbit holes. This is kind of fun. Oops. <laughs> I lost one. That was unintentional. I almost got 20. Is, am I really going to lose out because one fell out? Oh. Your score is 19. What the? That's amazing. Even us reader can't put up scores like that. What's your uh -huh. secret? You deserve a real award. Yeah, okay. Hmm? Nah, ah. I'm good. That's just... Where is this castle mocking? Where is it? Let's see, I'm right next to the other one. No, this is completely wrong at this point. I'm going to this tower. If I can't find out with this one, I'll just, I'll leave it be. What? Where is that? Didn't I go near there?
Can I? I'm just gonna fucking drop on top of it. <laughs> oh, that was way further north. Wear the wingsuit. Hang on, I need a. It is too cold, but I think I can do. There we go. That should be fine. either underneath the rock or it's immediately here. It's probably underneath the rock. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good! Zelda's in the past now. As I thought, this is not the world I know. A time so far back in the past, it's become legend. So it's true. This is really the era of Hyrule's founding? Your presence here is just as strange to us, Zelda. But if you, like Sonya, have a secret stone and are able to manipulate time, then your story makes sense. Oh? I believed her right away. You needed the secret stone as proof, Raru? I can feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. Ancestor? Uh, I see. In any case, Zelda. You had said that you needed to return to your era as soon as you possibly could. Yes. In my time, something terrible is happening. I need to get back there. But how do I do that? I don't even know how I got here in the first place. <laughs> Now, Zelda, dear, oh. you don't need to solve your problems all at once. Why not come back with us to the castle, hmm? No, I... We'll tell everyone that you're a, a distant relative of ours. <laughs> it is true, after all. We'll get you fresh clothes, too. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure an answer will come Your clothes you. are, uh... They're not great, Zelda. We'll get you. We'll get you new ones. Don't worry. We'll fix you right up. I don't know what to say. Hmm, I wonder, Minoru. She may have some idea of how to get you back to your era. Minoru, you said. Yes, she knows far more than anyone about our people. And like us, my older sister has a secret stone. We'll call on her. Okay.
This is technically Elden Province. <laughs> Near it, anyway. It's Highland, I think, but, you know, still. It's, it's right next to Elden. It's just on the edge of it. Yeah, look, Elden, Elden's right here. Okay, there's... Tafo runs right next to me. Okay. Sage Sacred Technique with the Owl, so we need to find the dragon guarded by the Owls. expecting. Really? Just that? Ugh. Okay. <laughs> Fine. Quest is done. Alright, well, we're sneaky sneaky. my plucky assistant getting to work bright and early. I know I can count on you to propel a research forward. Eh? You found it? The place the monolith was talking about. Mm. So there, that's where it was. Excellent. I'll go take a look mm. shortly. Hmm, seems there's nothing more you can help me with for now. I'll investigate alone for a while. Just check back in when I inevitably make a new discovery. I'm counting on you. Okay. Oh. Okay, well... Have I... I might need to take a photo of it. I'll, go, I'll quickly go take a photo of it. <laughs> Unless I need to talk to the statue. I wonder who did that. the photo. The goddess statue has been toppled. Okay, that's it. Now, map. Convenient. Briefly, I was in Elden for all two minutes and then just left. Ah, uh, that's funny. I should just do Elden last just to be comedic about it. I mean, yeah, I went there, but I didn't do anything. The 
explaining to a statue, Is this true? The goddess statue in that canyon has toppled? These are ill tidings, devout swordsman. That is the mother goddess statue. I implore you to help me restore her. Seek the golden spirit, Farosh, who looses lightning as she dances across the heavens. When you have Farosh's claw, offer it at the spring. Okay. Do I have Farosh's I Maybe I do? Let's see. I have some dragon parts. I don't think I got any Farosh parts. I got... Nadra. Okay, I have Nadra Claw. I don't have Farosh parts. Alright, that's fine. Okay, now... This is the way to... to Elden. It's different now, so... Dude, what is that? <laughs> See what I mean? You just slip so much easier now. I don't know why. I feel like... On the one hand, things are better, but on the other hand... I don't know, I just find it way more jank now. Than it used to be. I am Legolas. Give me all your meat. check here because I have the same number of hearts that effectively got me the master sword so let's just see 3, 6, 9, 12 yeah 13 hearts Ugh, it's more darker than before yeah it's still being annoying I don't know We'll leave it for now. Just figured I'd check in case it was a, a heart barrier. Okay, we're heading to Aldeon. figure it out. Yeah, I'll figure it out. It's just, I'm not that stressed over it, to be honest. Huck. 
I need more of their parts. that just in case it's got to do with the underground That's brutal. What an asshole. That's supposed to be allies. <laughs> Good job, children. Well done, buddy. Killing the savage. Expecting a dead end here. Man of my word, here I am. I've arrived. Yeah, there's no lava, it's all just solidified now. There's water here now too. Whoa. Oh no. Had to. This is pretty cool, though. Kind of looks more like a death mountain than before. Especially, with, oh, especially with that going on. Wow. That is the death mountain we all know and love, trying to climb it with, without getting hit by a rock. <laughs> they put, they effectively put googly eyes on the statue. Oh, the rock mate. Whoa. Hey, hey, over here it's important. What is going on? You gotta let you in on something. There are some untrustworthy fellas rolling around the city right now. So if you're loaded up on ore, you should probably sell it before you get scammed out of it. <laughs> We're good, Gorons. We'll take it. We'll take it off your hands for a great price. How about three rupees for your ore? No thanks. Huh? Hey, what are you doing? Ah, uh, heal. Uh, uh, let's get out of here. 
Oh no. Mm. You almost got dipped there, huh? No, I said no. <laughs> now that the now that Death Mountain's eruptions have stopped and the lava has cooled, I've been seeing more Hylian oh. travelers. Which is great, except those two have been swindling travelers by offering to take their ore for next to nothing. After the marbled rock rose started surfacing, everyone around here has been acting strange. Mm. So be mindful of any Gorons who, who've who got marbled rock rose. Who are you? Mm -hmm. My name is Ramella. I'm a jeweler from Gerudo Town in the southwest of Hyrule. The ore that Unoboko deals in is high quality, so I always come here to replenish my stock. If you're open to it, I'll gladly buy your ore off you for my shop. Huh? Wow. Rude. I'd never rip you off. Well, I guess you did almost get ripped off, so your response is warranted. I'm not going to force you. If you decide to sell, let me know. Right now, I'm low on amber. If you sell me a parcel of ten, I'll buy them a little more. Okay. No, yeah, she was trustworthy in the previous game. I'll sell. Saxo. Oh, sorry. Saxo is an expression where I'm from. It means thank you. Kids these days shorten it to sock. That was very helpful. I'll buy ore from you anytime. Though keep in mind that I'm often looking for different ore at different times. So check in with me every now and then to see what I'm looking for. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I can see it from here. Yeah, ha ha! I did it! <laughs> Made it to Elden. Oh my god. It's like a pile of red meat. This is bad. Stop eating the meat! Cray, not you too, after all my warnings about the marbled rock roast. Everyone's acting funny because cause of the marbled rock roast that President Unobo is mining. What are you mumbling about over there? That's all the meat I gave to that guy. I mean, it's different meat. It would be funny. Canonically speaking. Oh my god. You're talking about marble rock roast, are ya? What is happening? Personality change. There's nothing to worry about, in my opinion. This is like mad cow disease for Gorons. Get over here, Goro! Huh? What could you want? <laughs> wow, that's an attitude change. Well, if it ain't Link, you're so tiny I barely even noticed you. You know, but what's the big deal talking like that to our esteemed guests? Also, the dude's wearing, like, leather print. <laughs> yeah, okay. Talking like that to our esteemed guest. He has ring- yeah, okay. Rings on his hands, yeah, okay. Bluto, sh or should I say boss? You really don't know your place, do you? Slurgo, tell me, who runs Goron City these days? Oh. You know, Bicko. And Afrak, who's in charge of Unibico? No. You are President Unibo. Ha! You hear that, Bluto? You're not needed around here anymore. Hmm. You think I'm just gonna sit here and... Oh. So, Link, what's your business in Goron City, huh? Huh? Princess Zelda, huh? And you're wondering about any strange going-ons? Mm. Princess Zelda, I heard she's gone missing, but you're telling me she's still missing? I mean, it's hard to miss those lovely blonde locks of hers, after all. Locks? Does that mean hair? Oh, oh, the lady with hair like that? She's the same one President Unobo talks to about marbled rock roast. Pipe down, you two. You'll keep your traps shut if you know what's good for you. As you can see, Goron City is the picture of peace, and we can't help with Princess Zelda. So you'd better shove off. 
I've got to go get more marbled rock roast. Can't afford to keep her waiting. You know, but I swear if you bring in any more of that stuff, I'll uh, uh, make it back. Stodgy old guy sticking your nose into things when you've got your spine to worry about. Slogo, off rack, time to head back to Univoco HQ. Ugh, oh, that guy. Used to be just a kid following me around, crying boss this, boss that. It was all business as usual around here. Then he created Unibuko, a group of Gorons who work the mines. Once they started digging up that marbled rock roast, Unibu and all the youngsters changed. Changed? <laughs> you heard me, changed. All due to that strange marbled rock roast Unibu dock up. Now all the youngsters just sit around eating it instead of working. Why, some of them are even running scams trying to get more marbled rock roast. There's no way he can't see what a mess we're in. But he keeps playing dumb. If it weren't for my darn spine, I'd march right into Unibuco's HQ and give Unibo a piece of my mind. But HQ is in a pain in the neck location, you see. For starters, I'd have to go through the northern mining site. Ugh! In this condition, I can't even ride a cart. What to do? Right, so basically we're not doing any shopping here. That's... 2,000? 5,000? You know what? That's semi-reasonable. That's not bad. Oh. Only reason I'm running this place is because Boss Blue will get mad if I close up shop. Okay, I mean, I'm not going to rush to get this yet because we don't need it. There might be a quest that gives us it. Because it did last time, so let's just not rush into things. We're not struggling here anymore. Is this anything? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Is it going to be the opposite where the Gerudo are just, like, all nice now? <laughs> so wait, are, it's, are these eyes because everyone's eating that rock rice and so the eyes should be like this? Oh, your eyes are normal. You gotta be kidding. Give me a break. That Hylian Blondie had me making the weirdest stuff. She said it was a simple task, but it looked funny to me, and she had me make it with an odd material. At the time, my apprentice Fugo kept me, kept saying he wanted to be a smithy like me, but now all he talks about is marbled rock roast. He won't so much as show his face around here anymore. Dag Nabbit, and it was finally time for me to pass along. The secret of our trade. How to make the boulder breaker. Boulder breaker? Customer. Sorry, Bob. I'm a smithy, not a shopkeeper. My focus is on the boulder breaker right now. The art of crafting such a butte has been passed down through the ages. Only a chosen few can make it. It's a historical weapon, making it an absolute honor. Here I thought I'd be teaching my apprentice Fugo to make it. But the fool's obsessed with that marbled rock roast stuff. It's all he cares about anymore. I told him to shove off right in the middle of work. I'm done with him. Oh yeah, right, Chulin's not here.
Okay. Wield wonders. That's a broken bridge. <laughs> Wait, am I? No, there's a ladder. Hey, Malus, how's it going? have to make a bridge and get across. I could I could cheese this. Doing well just got this. It looks so good. It is very good. Yeah. It's an improvement over Breath of the Wild in pretty much every way you can imagine. Because I'm on it, that's why. Uh... Okay, this will work. Kinda? <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Oh shit! <laughs> oh no. Okay. Yeah, the, uh, the, uh, uh, come back, please. Stop. Okay. Yeah, let's just do this. What? No, come on. It does it doesn't reach. Oh, it doesn't reach. Okay, keep it like that. Rewind. <laughs> it didn't attach. This doesn't do... Okay, so... I mean, you would assume I just have to put these two together. Uh, wait. <laughs> okay. Glad I caught that. No, I've, I've had it happen before. It, it doesn't work. <laughs> It just... One side tends to win. What is this abomination? Okay. That looks good. Sort of. just in case. Oh, it won't let me. Uh, I should be able to bring it with me. Come here. There we go. 
Oh shit! Whoops. <laughs> ah, uh, it's gonna reset its position now. I think. No, it's still here. Okay, good. Time for some road kill. <laughs> Alright, you're dealt with. Enjoy. That's not gonna bother me anymore. Earth is that over there? Uh, it's a double durability. Okay, I'll take it because you can charge these bows. Right. Are these landmines? They're landmines. Am I making a snowplow? No, they're not landmines. What are they? Okay, well... Almost did it again. about, right? Huh. Oh, you didn't have to get all of them. Cool. That was fun. I like that one. <laughs> yeah, I uh, did the shrine as intended, so it's all good. But yeah, uh, this game is great. It's just, oh, the rabbit holes this game has. When I started playing tonight, I wanted to make it to this area, and I have, but it's just three, four hours later. But I'm here. <laughs> now, I can get distracted all I want here. Wait, is there a goddess shrine here? Oh, you can pour water over red hot lava. It creates a patch of rock. Okay, so there's there's this as well. I've got to keep that in mind. I don't know, man. I feel like this is their own fault. Like eating what is effectively radioactive meat. <laughs> Can't really blame anyone. I, I wouldn't eat anything that was glowing. I'm just gonna look around and see. And one of them got infected. Someone was patient zero, so at that point, be like, hmm. 
probably shouldn't touch that stuff. Like, this is just... This is everything here is their own fault. There's no goddess shrine, really? Off to donate if I'll still be on. Nah, I think I'm, I'm basically done for tonight. It is late. But I wanted to upgrade one more time at least, but I don't think there's a goddess statue here. I haven't seen it. Yeah, maybe there isn't one here. Okay, in that case, I'll just go here. It's fine. This one's the easiest one. It's just in the middle. Yeah, see ya, Colin. Thanks for watching. I'll just upgrade my shit and just call it a day. But, uh, yeah, thanks everyone for tuning in. This was fun, as always. Tomorrow I'll continue Banjo-Kazooie and do more of this, so that's the plan. But in the meantime, as always, if you want to keep watching my content, uh, head on over to YouTube. Just search for the channel over there, you'll find it. Or you can go to my website, shambles.gg. has links to all that stuff, plus more. Hope you check it out. And if you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed and consider clicking buttons and doing algorithm fun stuff if you want to support. But now, next time I play this without without a shadow of a doubt, I'm going to be in the Elden area. There will be no distractions. There will be no traversing some other area for like three hours. We're just going to go straight to, uh, yeah, the Elden area and do the thing. So it should be fun. Health is looking good too. Um, I know I said my closing stuff, but you know. Let me see if I have enough for Korok. Mm. Where is Hestu? There you are. Yeah. Yeah. Thirty-five. Ooh, jeez. Uh, how much is a bow? Seventeen. I got a bow stash. <laughs> I love the dance so much. No, for now. Okay, and let's just go back here. So I'm not tempted by anything. I will start in Elden Region. I just figured there'd be a uh, a statue there that I could upgrade out. I mean, maybe there will be once uh, I fix whatever's going on here, but we'll find out tomorrow. So, hope to see you then. Ugh, damn it! <laughs> I'll, that's a, that's an obvious one. You know what? If I just leave the screen here, I'll I will see it next time. All right, chat. I'm gonna go to bed. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, appreciate you all for tuning in. And uh, we'll continue tomorrow. Alright. Bye, chat.